We are very excited to share some news with you regarding a new partnership in affiliate marketing. Can you guess who? <laughs> What is the chances of that? Let's say this good luck. Hello and welcome to One Step at a Time Farmstead. Join our family on our journey as we build a like-minded community while living life on our terms in accordance with our beliefs, our convictions, our desires, and above all, our faith in God and our God-given calling. We promote a self-sufficient, self-sustaining lifestyle, especially with regard to fresh produce and fresh meat and the preservation of their art. It is our objective to prove that the self-sufficient, sustainable, healthy, happy and fulfilling lifestyle is possible, even in an urban setting, while adhering to various laws, rules and regulations of our government. Our ultimate vision and goal are to obtain and establish functional and profitable farm enterprises where we produce wholesome foods grown and raised according to our conviction in the way that God intended. In other words, organic, natural, chemical free. Furthermore, it is our aim to teach and train in the various principles of self-sufficiency, self-reliance and food security. We foresee hosting, supporting and sponsoring masterclass training workshops in accordance to our call to the Ministry of God. With your support, we now we can achieve these goals. You guessed it. We parted with Timu and let us tell you why. But firstly, what is Temu? Temu is an online shopping platform that offers a wide range of heavily discounted goods. It is known for its aggressive social media advertising, referral offers and clearance sales to attract customers. Temu connects consumers with merchandise partners, manufacturers and brands that offer a near wholesale price. The platform is owned by PDD Holdings, <laughs> a Chinese corporation, and it has gained popularity quickly due to its low prices and extensive marketing campaign. Would you like to know more about how to use Temu or any specific products they offer? You may have noticed in some of our videos, some of the equipment or tools that we have used, and most of it we procured through Timu for ourselves before we even thought of partnering with them because we needed it and Temu offered it at great prices. Let us show you some of the products we have obtained through Timu. So why did we partner with Temu? From 2019, I've been struggling with unemployment as well as depression and anxiety as a direct result thereof. As many of you may know and understand, we needed to cut down on living expenses and become more self-sufficient and less reliant on our grocery stores and the supply chain. And with the increasing price of food and living costs, we needed to start making plants. This is when I decided to start growing our own vegetables. That was a way for me to provide for my family. And it was the perfect idea. I started with a small in-ground garden and this eventually became too small and I knew that I had to increase our garden size. And then using recycled materials I started making raised bed gardens. In order to help me cope with my 
mental well-being, I started this YouTube channel. Not as a source of income, but more like a journal type vlog for myself and my family, being able to capture my successes and failures and the challenges that I faced. And with this, I also just need to give a shout out to Maya and Jessica from Roots and Refuge Farm, Ben and Meg Holler from the Holler Homestead and Jason and Lorraine from So The Land. Because watching your YouTube channels and learning from you and seeing how you shared your journey and your challenges and your struggles, your ups and downs, and also your victories, along with your knowledge and skills and guidance was really a godsend aid to me and helped me in my darkest times. So after posting a few more videos, I started getting, you know, a little bit more views and more subscribers. And yeah, then I started thinking about, you know, really leaning into YouTube and see what we can maybe accomplish with it. We then relocated back to town, but we still had the vision to live more self-sustainable and more self-sufficient and decided that this time around starting on new ground, a new venue or new homestead, we will record all our major tasks and progress and then share them with our subscribers that we have them. In our vision, we wanted a fruit orchard or a mini food forest, as well as sufficient raised bed gardens and in-ground gardens to produce, you know, our fresh uh, produce. And the dream of raising chickens again in our backyard is also still something that my family and I really want to do. Again. <laughs> We knew that this would take time and expenses that we couldn't afford immediately. So we decided to purchase some things on a monthly basis that we need and build up from there until we could make that specific project a reality. So while shopping around physically and online on various platforms for quality products at affordable prices, we discovered then we were very skeptical at first, you know, especially with some people saying, you know, it's knock off products or bad service and Quite things it. like that. Poor quality. We were very skeptical, but, you know, decided to give it a shot. The first order was placed and now it was time to nervously wait. <laughs> What a surprise when our parcel arrived quite early. Okay, the items that we ordered, you know, the first time off was mainly clothing and beauty stuff, <laughs> beauty related product, just to test the service from my side and, you know, the quality of the products and basically the, the platform as a well. whole. Further searching other products on Timu through their catalogs and little divisions, you know, the different tabs, like for men, women, gardening, kitchenware, kitchenware appliances, you know, they've got all these little catalogs. Yeah, we discovered some products that could really, you know, that would really help and aid us in our homesteading journey and that aligns with our objective of living more uh, self-sufficient products from products for the for gardening to, to raising livestock from cooking to preserving okay and we will be taking a closer look at some of the items that we acquired for ourselves a bit later in this video with our partnership with Timu in their affiliate program, our viewers will also receive some benefits. The benefits include a 2,000 Rand coupon bundle as a new app user, 
uh, exclusive discounts when using our links and special offers and big savings. All you need to do is find the links in the description below. Here are some of the products that we have purchased for ourselves through Timu. Um, and you can find the links in the video description. Um, to order for yourself and to receive an exclusive discount on these products. Okay, first of all was our composting mat. I use this when I transplant from the seedling trays into pot and then if I mess it in the compost mat and not on the on the floor. Second of all, I use it like this where I take my seedlings and you know these edges slip up and it makes like you know like a bit of a bowl. It is waterproof so you don't have any water running onto the floor especially with the greenhouse being indoors. We've also purchased these little seedling pots from Timu when I pot up from from the seed trays to these pots. We also sell seedlings at you know the market so it's very very cheap sorry we had rain last night so it's a little dirty but yeah we take this to the market we sell our seedlings just like that we have also bought these landscape fabric or uh, weed barrier fabric this one is the interwoven fabric but this is the woven weed barrier and this one is like a cotton cloth one and we decided to try them both we've seen different reviews of the different ones and yeah we thought the, we would try it out for ourselves the idea behind this is that this is where our in-ground gardens will be and we will make the spots where we will plant directly in ground and this will keep weeds from choking out basically our young plants. We also have this one which is a perforated plastic one. Sorry it's a bit windy. And it already has you know the little holes for your seedlings and this we want to use in our raised bed gardens as basically a plastic mulch was also dirt cheap so we just want to dry it but it is quite thin so i don't know how it will perform we'll finish uh, preparing one of the race pit gardens and then try this out as well we've also got these landscape fabric staples or ground anchors to keep the the weed barrier in place what it looks like yeah, and this is just so that the wind won't blow everything away. We also got this four-tier mini greenhouse. You will remember this from a previous video when we set it up. And it's what the kids and my wife got for me for Father's Day this year. And I must tell you, I am so impressed with this little greenhouse. Definitely worth everything we paid for it then here in the office i still have some other things this is the poultry netting and this is seven and a half meters by 25 meters so this is still for an upcoming project where we will close the chicken run completely with this around and over the top wonderful stuff and also cheap. Here I've got a temperature controller and this will go to our incubator that I'm, it's also an upcoming project that I still need to build, but yeah, just to regulate the temperature within the incubator and brooder. I've previously used one of these for my distiller and it worked perfectly. This one also a temperature controller or a speed controller that we also got from Timu and this is what I'm going to use on my electric distiller just for the reason when this one reaches temperature it switches off and your temperature can drop a bit this one I'm going to use on the element for the distiller it's like a rheostat where you can just 
dial the amount of power that you put in. And for the studying, that is nice because you don't break the power source that it switches off and on. You can start off with full power input and when you reach temperature for your alcohol to distill, you can set it down to say 10% or 20% or 50% or whatever power input. You'll see on the distilling videos what I mean. It will just give me better control on regulating my temperature in my distiller but that's also an upcoming project but yeah got it for dirt cheap through timu i'll say at least a quarter of the price including import costs costs uh than what i would have paid for the same thing at an outlet here in south africa okay and off to the kitchen okay and for the kitchen we got this this is our Dali B, B press, or the first one that we got with its thermometer. We loved it so much, loved having our own Dali sandwich, lunch meat. We've made like a chicken and cheese was our first attempt uh, in this one. And then we made a cooked ham with pork uh, from pork neck. We made another one. Also chicken and cheese, but with a lot more spices, smoked paprika and stuff like that. So we can really basically play with our recipes and actually create something that we love. And we loved it so much that we got a second one, which means we can double up on our processed meats when we make this. We also got a canning tool set. I used the, so we used the bright tongs to get the jars out of the hot water. But ever since we got this set, it's basically with your funnels for canning. Bigger one, smaller one, tool to help you open the jars, the magnet for your lids, your bubbler tool, your jar grabber tool, <laughs> and some tongs. And something that we still need to use is our sausage maker or sausage press. I just think this one is really cool. You have the different size nozzles that can fit. Yeah, this is for nice thin walls, drew walls that we can make. Fill up your cylinder and here's your press. Casing will go over this nozzle and you, know, you can basically make it for the size sizes that you like. Bologna or summer sausage, <laughs> salamis, stuff like that. <clears throat> We're still going to have a lot of fun with this. Let me just go get that. But that felt. So it's not a huge thing, but I'm sure it's going to be a very helpful aid in our charcuterie efforts, making salamis, summer sausages, and all kinds of sausages. But this is like one of the smaller ones, but we'll still test it out there. These are some of the products that we got for ourselves for homesteading, or that will help us in our homesteading endeavors. Okay, so obviously with Temu and their prices, we've been purchasing other household items. Anything from clothing, jewelry, junk journaling supplies, shoes, watches, nails, <laughs> makeup. Yeah. All the good stuff. Yeah, the list is endless. That's that's where we start. It just... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, the list is endless. But with all of this, we've never really had problems with our orders. Deliveries always actually been quite early. There were two, not problems, but okay, the one was a problem. Your... Right. So um, I ordered a tumbler and once it had arrived and we'd opened the package, the lid of the tumbler was broken, it's in pieces. Tim was, though, however willing to exchange the product for us. Yeah, no problems whatsoever. And then another thing is a laptop, <laughs> a laptop bag that she ordered, but never checked the dimensions. So instead of getting the laptop bag that I originally wanted, I ended up with a new lunch bag. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
small little thing. But that was because she didn't check what she ordered. Yeah. I just saw and I was like, who I like, and yeah. I added. Just saw something pretty and she added it to the basket. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Um, basically, yeah, I believe the tumblers little lid that broke happened somewhere with the careers or in transport um, but like we said they were fine with you know exchanging the product and you know, the other one was really human error on our side because afterwards when we went back to the description on what she ordered they gave the dimensions and saw it was a tiny bag <laughs> But she can use it as a purse. Thank you. <laughs> Sunflowers. Where is it? Show them. <laughs> oh, so here it is. This is my laptop bag. <laughs> <laughs> it's not sunflowers, it's daisies or something. Daisies. But yeah, it will teach you to read the description. <laughs> On what you order, but yeah, still a lovely little bag. Yeah, I still use it. My lunch it is insulated. It's got a little zippy part in front as well. Or just as my handbag, which I've used it as as well. Basically, in conclusion, with the stuff that we bought from Timu and that we have used, we feel quite confident to endorse them. Any disappointment on products that came incorrectly or whatever was our mistake we feel confident enough to say at this moment in time we endorse Timu and we will continue with the affiliate program or, and we are excited about it at this moment quality and price that we find from it I think Timu is our preferred supplier of the goods that we order Compared to other online platforms that we have access to, like I said, some of the things are really a quarter of the price or less and then basically the same quality. I understand that people can also buy junk, but that is also because they don't look at what they are buying. She will go through how to order from team step by step with you. Or well, she normally does. <laughs> the purchases I add to the basket, she pays. <laughs> okay. okay, so firstly you need to download the Temu app. That can be done in your Play Store or we'll put the link in the description below. Okay. So once you've got Temu, I'm going to show you now how to download. Yeah, and she'll take a screen recording that we will... Add, add. Okay. Okay, so once you download Temu, your screen will come up like this. You'll see they've already started with the Black Friday specials as well. Okay, but on the screen you can go search through electronics, bags, home, woman, office. There's all the different um, catalogs. catalogs that they have. Or you can just use the search button. And um, hmm, what are we going to be ordering today? Let's look for. Uh, okay, so we'll be looking for a pot stall, which Temu has. You can go through the different prices, different, uh, products. different products, different if you're suppliers. looking for uh, different suppliers as well. Um, I'll just be choosing this one for now so you can click on it 
it's got the full description there um, what it is three gallons stainless steel alcohol distiller um, it's got a built-in thermometer water pump a double stumper keg home brewing kit okay so it's perfect for whiskies and brandies as you scroll down you'll be able to read people's reviews of the product tells you who distributes it and a little bit more information with the specifications as well then all you do is add to cart and it will tell you as well that there's only a certain amount left okay. in your shopping cart mine is quite full um you'll see on the side it will give you like a little circle with a tick in it that means it is in your shopping cart for purchase at this stage um if you only want to say for example order the pot still now you'll just go remove all the ticks tick the pot still and it will tell you that your total shopping price okay um from there proceed to checkout you will choose your payment method, payment method eft google play you can pay with your card and um, you can apply your coupon code there you'll enter it and then submit order so from here um, your order has been submitted and within normally about two to three days sometimes earlier you will receive a notification of your um, import costs that need to be paid um, it will also take you to a secure online site where you can put your banking details in or however you choose to pay and from there normally about a week maybe sometimes a little bit more uh, depending on flights and if there's joining flights you'll receive your order okay should you be interested in purchasing any of the items you've seen today the promo codes will be in the description link below this will also earn you exclusive discounts and assist us with a small commission on the side which will be a benefit for both of us so i hope you enjoy your time of shopping so for interest sake I just want to know, you know, have you ever ordered from Timu? Have you ever heard from Timu? Um, have you had any experiences with them? If you have, please leave a comment, you know, in the comment section and tell us about your, your experience with them and, um, wow. yeah, what you think of them. Um, if not, and you want to give it a shot, also let us know in the comment section um, and yeah, share whatever your future experience will, will then be with them. Or, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you think that you would give Timu a shot, also, you know, just Tell us there in the comment section. Um, or just share some of your um, homesteading tips that you can share with us or maybe, you know, your preferred supplier where you find good quality products at an affordable price. We will really appreciate that as well. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, to the channel for more content like this. Um, if you like this video, give a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, help us grow this community, and yeah, we really appreciate it. Please remember to like and subscribe if you like content like this, and ring the notification bell to follow along on our journey. We thank you for spending the day with us. We love you, we appreciate you. God bless you. Goodbye. Bye.
Bye. <laughs>